Transistors can be used as voltage controlled switches and current amplifiers. They have three leads, a base, collector and emitter. A bipolar transistor is controlled by applying a voltage of more than 0.7 volts to the base of the transistor. This will result in a small current to flow into the base and out of the emitter and will cause the resistance between the collector and the emitter to fall. When a transistor is switched off, the resistance between the collector and the emitter is high and when it is switched on, the resistance is low. Transistors are analog devices which allow a larger current to flow from the collector to the emitter as the base current increases. They are used as current amplifiers and electronic switches. A voltage of about 1.5 volts between the base and the emitter turns the transistor fully on. The switching speed of a bipolar transistor is one millionth of a second. You can also use two transistors to make a Darlington pair. Darlington pairs can control a higher power load and can respond more rapidly than a single transistor. You can buy Darlington pairs in packages which contain two transistors in a single device which will save space and time. An example of this is a BCX38. There are also FETs or field effect transistors. On an FET there are three leads, the gate, the drain and the source. If the voltage at the gate is above 2 volts, the drain source pattern switches on. Generally a larger current can flow and the current drawn at the gate is negligible. FETs are often used to interface picks and large circuits to drive higher outputs by increasing the current and voltage, for example a relay.